My name is William Clayton, and I am the mysterious mallet man. I'm nothing like those comments say, but sometimes I kind of wish I was. Be cool. I'm a junior at Anderson High School here in Anderson Township, outside of Cincinnati, Ohio. I've been in band here at Anderson High School for the past three years, and I've been in band since fifth grade. In the marching band, I play mallets. Uh, my freshman year, I played vibraphone, and the last two years, I've been playing marimba. So, <laughs> how this meme started, I guess, well, let me tell you the story. So, when we went to go get our band photos my freshman year, I thought everything was fine. Uh, I went in my uniform, I got my mallets, and I did the pose that the photographer asked me to do, and I thought it was all good. And then a few weeks later, when they bring the composite of all the band pictures to my school, and they hang it up, I notice that I'm in the very corner, one of the most obvious pictures, and it was labeled unknown. I'm not sure how this happened, I don't know why they labeled me as unknown, but everyone thought it was funny, and they were making fun of me and calling me unknown and whatnot, and everyone just kind of played it off as a joke. And then, about, I don't know, a month later, it popped up <laughs> on Reddit, and it became this viral picture that started appearing all over the internet, all sorts of websites and meme pages, all sorts of social media accounts. I was not expecting something like that to happen to me. It was life-changing. Three years later, that picture still comes up on different web pages. And people text me and message me on social media, say, hey, I just saw this picture of you on this meme page. I thought it would last maybe a month, and no, it's, it's still going. There was even one instance where someone recognized me in public as unknown, someone I had no idea who they were. I had never spoken to this person before, and they passed me, and they were like, what's up, unknown? And I was like, what? Now that I've had time to reflect on this crazy, crazy thing that happened to me, I've decided that I want to find the person who made this meme. I'm determined to meet them because this changed my life. Well, the night I first saw the Mysterious Mallet Man meme, I was just sitting on the couch watching TV with my parents. My brother was at band practice. And all of a sudden, my friend started spamming me with text messages with links to a Reddit post. And I opened the links and saw that my brother had apparently become a viral meme on Reddit. And I started laughing uncontrollably, and then I showed my parents because they wanted to know why I was laughing uncontrollably. And then they started laughing, and then almost as if on cue, my brother returned from band practice and walked in the door to discover us all laughing and telling him that he had become a viral meme. <laughs> my friends, they went crazy. We have a, a day at school, uh, all sorts of different spirit wear days and there was one year we had a meme day and a large group of kids from the band wore pictures of my face around the school <laughs> uh, a friend of mine even made a fake political campaign for unknown it started getting really out of hand and <laughs> the people around me and my friends and the people at school, they, they embraced it more than I did, I think. They had a blast. 
All right, I am here at Anderson High School, and I'm going to show you guys uh, the original meme, where it's from. This is where the meme originates. Follow me. Look at all these pictures. That's it right there. This is where it originates from. The funny thing about this too is I wasn't the only unknown. There are a few others. It's just I was the most obvious. This is where it comes from. My name is Mr. Gall, and I am the band director here at Anderson. Uh, I know it started as part of the composite that we did for the Forest Hills Band a couple years ago, uh, and some students' names, for whatever reason, didn't get to the photography people, and instead of just leaving a blank, they said unknown. And I guess for some reason, there was one student in particular who I think was named William, but it's unknown, so I can't remember. Uh, and it just kind of blew up on the internet, it became a meme. Unknown band boy. Yeah, he may exist, I don't know. All right, thank you, Mr. Gall. Sure thing. thing to come up. When your band's famous but you're the drummer, at least I can go out in public and not be bothered. That's true. But uh, there are a lot, of, a lot of these. He is the final boss. When you beat the rest of the hell band, you have to fight him. He is unknown, the drummer boy of the damned. Okay? This is just on Google Images. This isn't even like a meme page or anything. So, I really didn't know how I was going to go about finding whoever made this meme. Uh, but then I realized that I knew where the original post was. Uh, and I have it saved. So this is the original post. It's called Mallet Boy the Mysterious One. It's on a subreddit, on Reddit, of course, called Boss Fight. Uh, the description of Boss Fight is pictures of things that could be boss fights. So, it, it's a meme page. But here it is. It's uh, Malaboy the Mysterious One. Has 40.9 thousand upvotes. <laughs> it's crazy. 369 comments, 96% upvoted. So what I'm going to do, because I know that this is the original post, I'm going to go on the account of the person who posted it and see if I can find anything that will show me who they are, and if not, I, I'm going to message them. Because I know for a fact this is the original post. There are tons of people from my school in the comment section going, Oh, this is, this is William, I know him. So, that's my plan. If it doesn't work, 
I have a few, I have a plan B and a plan C, but they're going to be a, a lot harder and take a lot more time, so this is my plan as of now. Here's the user, uh, it was posted by a user called Borealidus, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right at all. Look at that. He posted the uh, the same picture in a different subreddit. So before I uh, I try and get in contact with the person who posted this, I'm gonna look at some of the comments because some of these comments are hilarious. There's percussionists in the comment section arguing about what mallet instrument those mallets are meant for, whether or not it's a marimba or a vibraphone or a xylophone. <laughs> marimba man sounds better. Well, yeah, most people started calling it mallet man. Uh, the mysterious mallet man. Yeah, here's a percussionist. Those mallets are too hard for marimba. Those are middle octave xylophone mallets. Actually, they're vibraphone mallets. I like this comment. Let me tell you, that is a great frickin' shirt. Marching band, done. Star Trek convention, we gotcha. Masonic temple, active robe, bring on the protractors, my friends. A lot of Star Trek jokes. But there's a lot of stuff on here that's, that's hilarious, and it, if you know the picture, you know the meme, and you haven't looked at these comments, you have to, because some of these are, some of these I'm probably not gonna say. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can figure out who this person is that posted it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go on their account and I'm just gonna message them. Unless there's something super obvious on their account that shows who they are, I'm gonna message them and say, hey, this is the guy, this is unknown. And, uh, I need to talk to you. That's what I'm gonna say. So, wish me luck. Alright. I think it's time. Orealidus. I'm coming for you. Can you hear me now? Yeah, I can. <laughs> so I think this is the first time I've ever spoken with you in person. Ooh. Maybe. I, maybe. I don't know. I feel like that's a little hard to believe. But... Basically, I wanted to figure out who made that meme. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I People told me it was you, and then other people told me it was other other people. I didn't know, and I, I, what I did was, I went on the Reddit post, and I clicked on the username, I went to the account, and I saw a picture of Ryan Macheski, and I was like, okay, it's probably Sam Sadler. So, um, yeah, that's kind of how I figured it out. Um, so I want to ask you, when did, like, what prompted you to post that? And when did you see that picture originally? Well, I mean, it's, I don't know. It's, I'm thinking back, I think it was senior year. So it's, I don't know, it's kind of hard to remember, like, details about it. But I just remember being in band class or rehearsal one time, you know, just kind of bored. So I started reading the, uh, the yearbook um, pictures that they had posted up. And I, I started at the beginning, you know, there's your face and the photo, little unknown name tag right underneath. And I said, that's, that's strange. That picture, it's a completely like undoctored, like that's a, just a normal picture I took. I didn't like edit it or anything. Um, so I was just like, well, that's funny. And like, I don't know, it was funny at first, like at first glance, it's funny, but then you think about it more, it's like, it's even more funny. Cause like, 
They took the picture. They have this kid. They don't know his name. Nobody knows his name. There's no way we're gonna find out. Let's just say it's unknown, right? Yeah. That's the answer. I, yeah. I find that funny. Um, so yeah, I just, I mean, I posted it once, um, and it sort of took off from there. I didn't really, I didn't really pay attention to it after that at all. I have to admit. Yeah, um, I noticed going back. I, I went and found the composite. Um, with all the band pictures for this documentary. Mm -hmm. And I noticed that there were actually two other people that were labeled as unknown. So it really? wasn't just me, but they were like, they were really hidden, like in the mm -hmm. middle. I guess mine was just like really obvious because it was on the side. Yeah, if I remember correctly, yours was at like the first of a like alphabetically ordered. <laughs> yeah. So your name's not, your name wouldn't even go there anyways. So that's, I don't know. Yeah. Um, what did you think of the response to your post on Reddit and other places? Uh, I was surprised for sure. Um, I thought it might get, um, I don't know, maybe a few likes, whatever I put, but definitely didn't expect it to go. Um, I guess I didn't go like super viral, but I got some moderate amount of attention more than anything else I posted on the internet. So I guess that's my legacy. Right? <laughs> do you have was there any specific response that was your favorite like any comment or anything of that sort or do you not remember I don't remember specific comments on the post my favorite response was just the people that I knew responding to the fact that it went viral I guess because they thought it was they thought the whole thing was hilarious and I mean so did I how do you feel ab about the meme like would you consider it to be like really how funny do you think it is because funny do i think um i don't know maybe i just have a weird sense of humor i i definitely thought it was more funny i guess I probably thought it was more funny back then um it's like i don't know it's like specific you know yeah it's definitely funny but it's not like it's not like in the way that you like tell a joke and it's funny you know it's just kind of like you see it, it's like oh that's strange and it's weird that it happened it's something that like if someone made it intentionally it wouldn't really be funny but the fact that it's like in real life that's really funny yeah because it's not like normal memes where there's a caption and a funny mm -hmm. picture it's just it's literally a picture from a band picture composite yeah um that's what i think is actually really awesome about all right well Thank you. Um, good luck with your break. Have fun. Happy holidays, <laughs> you know. Um, Thanks, man. Tell everybody in the film class I said hey. All right, I will. All right, I'll let you go. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks again. for the chat. This one. <laughs> yep. All right, I'll see you. See you, dude.